Friday morning. I need to tell y'all a funny story. So, <laughs> we um, bought one of those bidets that go like on your toilet seat, like attaches to your existing toilet. My husband's wanted one forever, and so he got one. And he, it's been sitting in the box for like six months, and he finally installed it. Y'all, I wish I would have recorded him when he came out of the bathroom. <laughs> The first time he used it, he, I should not be doing this when I'm driving. He, his eyes were like this big. And he's like, I'm like, what is wrong? He's like, I used it. I'm like, okay. And he's like, I just got violated. I just got violated by the water. He's like, the pressure was too high. And I've been violated. <laughs> oh my god. I should have been parked. Oh. I was. <laughs> I wish I would have recorded him because <laughs> the look on his face was priceless. Oh. But now he has the pressure figured out. And it's good to go just in time for the toilet paper shortage of the coronavirus. But, oh my gosh, y'all. Oh, it was seriously like the funniest thing I ever saw and it is kind of a shock the first time you use one of those I mean luckily the water's warm and you're like prepared but it uh it's pretty interesting but we won't have to worry about the toilet paper shortage so I guess that's nice we don't have to get with that I don't really know <laughs> anyway just wanted to share my funny story about my husband being violated by the bidet <laughs>